several structures used to be standing tall at this area in Bandung village, but after the passage of the heavy runoffs, just few houses could resist the force. The strong breeze and heavy downpour that struck the zone has destroyed houses, schools, and bridges. Water has destroyed the whole of Bandung. The first bridge that separated Bandung and Bamekwin has been taken away. We can't see anything apart from water everywhere. Without a clear passageway, the water provoked landslides that has rendered many families homeless. The victims didn't only lose their properties, but also administrative documents. I lost all of my documents. Identity card have been taken away. Important documents, books and pens are all gone. If Bandum village was badly hit by the flood, they are not the only one nature was against. For Mopia, Ndunde, for Chufe and Safe weren't left untouched. Some villages in Sancho subdivision were also touched by the floods with about 90% of houses destroyed. The divisional officer and mayor of Fokwe were on the ground to evaluate the losses. The mayor and myself thought it wise to come and cry with you and also give feedback to our hierarchy. For them to arrive the zone, part of the journey was on foot and another on commission motorcycles. Thank God some houses are still standing. I beg on those whose houses are up to help the others. Without shelter, the victims are expecting aid from the government and people of goodwill. Yeah!